Hey guys, welcome back and welcome to the vlog. My name is Tawana and it is another day of Vlogmas. So today we have our last minute shopping to do as far as Christmas. Um, I really have to get some things really, we're doing like a secret Santa at work. So I need to get the last couple of bits for that gift for the person I got. Um, then I want to return some stuff to Zara. We need to stop by Target. I want to also maybe go to Saks or Neiman Marcus to see, um, check out this perfume. I got a sample of and it smells so good. So I want to see if they actually have, you know, the actual full bottle in stock. Um, what else we got to do? I think those are like the main places. So we'll be, you know, going to downtown a little bit. Um, don't know if I want to go to Phipps Plaza, but we'll be going to Lenox Mall for sure. So yeah, so a little bit of a shopping day, mall day. And come along with me on this, you know, day of Vlogmas. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, of course, join the family. We're going to keep growing into 2022. But it is actually just about 10.03 a.m. I just finished getting ready, curled my hair, did my makeup. Um, I'll give you guys an outfit of the day fully at the mall. Um, I have on this little cute like bodysuit from Zara. And then you can see some blue jeans <laughs> with that. I accessorized a couple of things. I'm wearing my Louis um, little bracelet finally. And then I have these really cute rings that I got from Majuri as well. So I've got this one and then another one on this finger. And then some other rings from like ASOS that I have. But yeah, I'm going to finally be wearing these really cute boots. They're brand new guys, so that's why they're on the bed. But I'm going to be wearing these boots, all booties, cream. And then I have to iron my, I'm just going to put on this little cream blazer as well to match. So I'm going to iron it a little bit. It's a bit wrinkled. So that's what we're wearing to go with the little neutral fit. And yeah, I'm going to iron this real quick and we can get out of the house and get going. Okay, I'm ready, guys. Um, Again, I'll, I'll show you the full fit when we get, you know, in a big mirror at the mall. So I want to get out of here, but it's giving, it is giving very much business casual with the blazer. Um, but I really do love it. This little bag here is actually from Zara as well. So pretty much Zara it out today a little bit. And then I have the returns we're doing. Well, exchange, cause I'm going to spend the money on something else, honestly, <laughs> at Zara. So we're going to do that. Um, but first I'm thinking maybe Target first. I'm also going to show you guys how extra I am. So you know, I usually wear like the black face masks, right? Since the outfit is giving all cream, all businesswoman, I got me some white ones to wear <laughs> as a match. Um, so I just spritz down. We used a uh, Tom Ford Lost Cherry today. So we're looking good. We're smelling good. We're feeling good. And let's actually get out of this place. I'm outside in a damn jeep. Right outside. TT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Okay, let's go to Neiman Marcus. See what we can find for perfumes. Yeah, you know, try to see what perfumes you can find. And um, then I'm hungry, so I'm gonna go eat right after that, to be honest. <laughs> This one to Saint Laurent. I wonder why I sell on it too. They don't have a black one in stock. Yeah, I'm good. How are you? Oh, 
Yeah, yeah, I was just looking to. Well, have well, you smelled them before? No. Oh, okay. Everybody told me about the exclusive, so I was like, okay, okay let's, let's start from the beginning. Okay. This is Delino. Right. Delino will be your soft rose with some different other ingredients. Mm -hmm. So every woman that smells it falls in love. I like it. Very soft, like it does. Very soft. Love it. But not. Then they came out with the Linux exclusive. This was like, I want to be powerful. I want to make that statement. If I'm going out to dinner, right. if I'm in the office and people, is, you know, I got this big grand meeting and I'm walking in, I'm looking mm -hmm. good, and I want people to say, <laughs> wow, oh, yeah. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Yeah. So you can see how it graduated. Yeah, it's really like this went up a couple uh -huh. notches. Right, what's that one called? Um, this one's La Rose. La Rose, gotcha. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys, time for some food. But the Delina exclusive and the regular one are both like beautiful fragrances, but I like the bigger version, the big girl version, which is exclusive. So we need some tissue. We want this one. Or it's over. Hmm. The bag is over, so we'll do the red and white. Little trees. How cute are these? How much is this? Ten dollars. Okay. I got the mini countdown calendar too. Tree countdown calendar. Huh. And they have the days until Christmas. Look at this. How cute is this? Oh my god. I wish I saw this earlier. I would have got it. Good news, I found the cozy socks. A whole wall of them. <laughs> Let's pick out a pair for my secret Santa. I kind of prefer these down here because they have little like grippers at the bottom. So they have it in like the red, the black, snowflakes, and they're like short, well, shorter as far as the uh, ankle length. I don't know which ones though. Okay. I'm just gonna settle on this pair. They're very festive, they're red and white, and they got snowflakes. Can't go wrong with that. So I am back home, you guys. Um, cozy change and everything. I just wanted to quickly show you guys a couple of things I got. Um, I only picked up, I forgot to go to freaking H&M. So, I mean, I didn't, I didn't really need anything. I was just going to browse and see what they had, but I kind of didn't forget. I was just tired, to be honest. Um, <laughs> the mall wears me out. I'm not even going to lie. Y'all, you know, I've said it before, but I love online shopping. But it's always good to go to the mall once in a while, especially like when it comes to perfumes, because I wanted to like actually smell a couple of them. Um, I went to Neiman Marcus and they didn't have the Dear Polly. Yeah, that's the name. It's by... Wilhelm, Wilhelm Perfumery, but they didn't have that one in stock. They said it's only online, but I know how it smells, so I'm gonna just order the actual big bottle eventually. And then you guys saw that I actually went to Zara. Got a very big bag here, but I'm actually I'm gonna be filming a Zara haul. Um, it won't go up today or tomorrow. It's gonna go up on Christmas Eve, perhaps. No. It's gonna go up on Wednesday. Yeah, so <laughs> it's gonna go up this Wednesday, which is I think the 22nd. So you guys will see that then. I picked up some things in store. I returned the two things. Funny thing is I returned, if y'all watch one of my earlier vlogs, I returned one of the things I got there, 
Let me see if I can pull it up real quick here for you guys to see. It was, if you remember that shirt that I said made me look like a Narcos member, the agent, I returned that one. And then I was gonna exchange the leggings that I had, the black, you know, full leather leggings for the pair that I actually like. Yeah, so. I don't even have it in black no more, damn. But this was the one I showed you guys in that last haul where it was basically in black and I didn't like the fit of it. But it's not I wanted, they didn't have my size and stuff. They had like one pair that was like an extra large left. So hopefully it's still online. I can, you know, purchase it there. But I just did the return and I picked up five things. Um, they're really cute, of course. Can't wait to show you guys. So be sure to, you know, tune in for that in two days to see what I actually got. And I also want to show you guys two more things that I picked up before that when they had their Black Friday sale. Um, I just want to put that in there because you guys, you know, the sale for like end of the year is coming up, I think on a 26th. So at least you can have an idea of like, what might you might want you know based on that haul but moving on oh actually before i move on i also try to um smell the new fragrance line that they had it is the zara and joe malone collaboration and the girls were raving about what's it something madrid elegantly madrid or something one of them um i smelled all of them you guys i didn't really like none of them not the tokyo to new york energetically new york none of that stuff it just wasn't my type of thing Compared to like Ebony Woods, you know, it was just not, not top tier to me. So only one I did like was something called Red Vanilla. So I might eventually pick that up if I just want, you know, really want it. But it was all right to me at best. But yeah, so definitely check it out if you can. The only thing I don't like about it is the placement in the store that I go to at Zara. It's like before checkout. So you're literally in line and you know Zara's lines are like always so dang long. You don't want to actually, you know, tell people to go in front of you or anything because it just takes so long. I wish they had a self-checkout like the store in Miami did in um, the mall. Anyhow, so you're like frantically trying to, you know, smell these fragrances and moving up the line so that you're not, you know, holding people up behind you. So I wish they could like, just put that towards a side somewhere that people could take their time and kind of sniff those and smell them and see what they like. But hey, whatever. Moving on, like I said, I got three things from Sephora, but I'm only going to show you guys two of them because one is actually a gift and... Can't let them see because they watch a the channel. But the two I got, I needed a new mascara. So yeah, I picked up the Lancome Idol. And this is their mascara. Let's see if I can focus that in for you guys. Yeah, so it looks like this in the bottle. Well, this is the packaging, I should say, really. And this is the travel size, um, just black mascara. I like the little curvature on the actual product here. Look at that. I hope you can see it. But yeah, it's really nice. Um, I really like that as well. So that's the brush and yeah, I just need a new mascara so I can actually do like, you know, my bottom lashes, that sort of thing. I got that and then I got my Laneige sleep mask. Um, yeah, the lip sleeping mask. I got this. I feel like everybody knows what this looks like because every YouTuber influencer raves about this <laughs> lip sleeping mask. And I also saw, well, somebody told me that they have the um, lip balm, like a regular lip balm. So I might check that out eventually, see how that is. But yeah, I picked up those two from Sephora. Um, let's do our tea time, you guys. It is pretty chilly now out. It wasn't earlier, but it is now. So let's go see what tea we're having today. Okay, here's our advent calendar. Don't have much left. Let's shake it up. I don't know how that's going to help anything, really. And then pick one. I had this before. Did they put it twice in there? Let's pick another one because we already had this one. Ooh, purple. What is this? Darjeeling Summer Pure and Unblended Second Flush Black Tea. Cool. Okay, let's try her out. I snapped off the little part at the end so it might fall in the tag. We'll see. Oops, yep, fell in. Mm. It's hot. It's hot. Look at that steam coming out from the top, y'all. Okay, there goes nothing. Okay. Tastes like regular tea. See, I've never really had like, to differentiate black tea from other teas because I don't really drink black tea on its own. So it tastes like what well, if you had a typical tea without any flavor, that's what it would taste like to me. So it's good. It's very calming and cozy. It's doing the spot for me because it's a very cold and dreary day outside, like I told y'all. So, yeah, I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. But I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to wrap the vlog up right here. You know, thank you guys for watching. 
and coming shopping with me and all that today. Um, I know I was missing for like a week on, well, for Vlogmas, y'all. And what happened was, honestly, work, I was getting off so late every night. I would go to work at 8 a.m. I wouldn't get off until 7.15, one night, even 10 p.m. So I just didn't have the energy to edit after such long hours and long days. Um, it's not like I didn't film the videos. They're literally sitting on the memory card just waiting to be edited. So I was just like, by Wednesday, I was like, I just got to take an L. I can't do it this week. I'm just exhausted beyond measure with, um, you know, my actual work. So really sorry if you guys are waiting on that. I know a couple of people actually messaged me about it. So I apologize, but we're going to finish off Vlogmas right here. Well, not right here, but we're going to finish it up for the rest of the, um, you know, the days. And thanks again for watching. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow, of course, for our next video. Bye, guys.